Welcome property viewers to another property tour. Today we are at Bertram Paradise Villas in Discovery Bay, St. Anne, just under an hour from Antigua Bay in the west and just a little over an hour from Kingston on the other side of the island. Very close to major attractions such as Puerto Seco Beach which is five minutes drive from here and Green Grotto Caves on the other side which is less than five minutes as well. So I want to thank Neville and Kida for having me once again on this great channel to highlight our properties. I also want to thank the property manager here um, for facilitating this store. Beautiful properties we have here in Jamaica and in particular for me on the north coast of Jamaica. So welcome again and I hope you enjoy this tour. This is another end of the property. This beautiful infinity edge swimming pool takes advantage of this view of the sea right here in the background. I couldn't have asked for a more perfect day. Beautiful, clear skies, bright sunshine. And we actually have steps leading to a little wooden deck here. And if somebody's adventurous enough, they can venture out onto the rocks for either fishing and if you are super adventurous, there's a little cove there that you can actually take a dive and swim. I would not recommend that to the faint-hearted though. You would really have to be adventurous and a good swimmer to take advantage of this own natural pool here. So this expansive pool deck also hosts a gazebo with a wet bar and a barbecue grill to take advantage of the outdoor offerings of this beautiful property, which is just over an acre of land space. The property features five villas in a row. Each of them are three bedrooms with three bathrooms. The primary bedroom is upstairs. We'll see the details of that as we enter. And then the two other secondary bedrooms are on the ground floor. Each villa offers a lot of outdoor space. This is one such example right here. Before we enter the villa, one can actually relax here to take advantage. Welcome property viewers to villa number five the first of five villas on this property However, we'll only feature two of these villas because three of the others are the identical layout of this one. The only difference is the first villa, which, is, which houses the office and the laundry area. So, as you can see, bright colors, very airy, a lot of natural light flows through this villa. It's, fully, it's being sold fully furnished with appliances. A very large kitchen 
here. Granite countertops. And a very open concept, so you can actually be dining and having a conversation while cooking with family and friends. May I add, this property is very ideal for, they host a lot of family reunions, company retreats, because it's very ideal for that kind of setting. The living room has, outdoor, has access to outdoor space at the back. And on this floor, we have two bedrooms. The first with ensuite bathroom. This is not the primary bedroom property of yours, but it does have its own ensuite bathroom. Nice, spacious bathroom. And the bedroom has an inverter air conditioning unit, as do the other two bedrooms, which are very important in this day when we're trying to be very energy efficient. As you know, inverter units burn less current than the regular, traditional. This is the second bedroom downstairs. bathroom is just off the bedroom but easily accessible but very functional in that if you have guests in the living room they can also access it before that there's access to the backyard from the living room so I'll just give you a glimpse of that here Whoa. nicely landscaped backyard here which offers its own privacy as well by this natural hedge and as you can see they made good use of the land space there's a banana tree right there so other than the ornamental floors there's ground provision as well and this is a nice little patio if one wanted to retreat, to relax, read a book, entertain, whatever you want to do. This is an additional outdoor space that one can take advantage of. Alright, so next up is upstairs, which offers the primary bedroom. I, would, I wouldn't even say a primary bedroom, it's that whole suite upstairs. It has its own balcony at the front and then a semi-wraparound balcony at the back which takes advantage of the sea the beautiful sea view on offer here in discovery bay nice hardwood floors upstairs which is a nice change from the porcelain tiles downstairs look at this expanse of a bedroom property viewers
you couldn't ask for more. This in and of itself is a sweet. And to top it off is the high vaulted ceiling which allows it to feel even bigger than it is and provides a whole different experience. There's a nice little balcony here which off affords a sea view looking west and as I had mentioned before it does have a semi wraparound balcony So viewers were heading from the primary bedroom into the bathroom. which is a whole other experience. As you can see, this bathroom has built, made, they made good use of space. There's, there are built-in drawers and, and cupboards on either side of the bathroom. Travertine tiles on the wall and in the shower stall. And even the bathroom offers a view of the sea. So it's a totally different experience, even in the bathroom. Couldn't ask for more. This is somewhere somebody could cool out for the day with the amount of space that it affords. As you can see, double sinks for a couple so that you're not in each other's way. So this bathroom affords a lot of space for vacationers. And did I mention to you that this property is also for vacation rental? So if you are buying it, it's an excellent income earner. This particular villa rents for 350 US per night and it sleeps six. So it's three bedrooms, three bathrooms, and it sleeps six guests for 350 US a night. That's a good deal. The other units are the same layout. The other four units, sorry, the other three units are the same layout, except for the balcony, which is not a 180 degree. That gives you the sea view, and those rent for 250 US a night. So, viewers, the, the view speaks for itself. Take a look at this breathtaking view. So property viewers, this concludes the inside tour of one of the villas, villa number five. As mentioned, the other three villas are the identical layout as this one. So the other feature we'll have is on villa number one, which houses the office, the laundry area and the caretakers quarters, because the layout of that is different so that you can have an appreciation for it. Thank you. Well, welcome to villa. 
number one, which I could I would consider this the headquarters of the property because it's like everything that you need is here. The communal laundry area to the back, which we'll see. But this this is an outdoor, another an additional outdoor space. It's really a carport if you notice, but they converted it to just a nice sitting area. And the little hedge around it creates a nice backdrop. Beautifully landscaped. Our next stop is literally back of the house. <laughs> the laundry area. So this is the communal laundry area where all the linens for all the, the villas are laundered here. And it also has a coin operated machine if any guests need to do their own individual laundry. And finally, it houses a bathroom which is accessible both from here for the caretaker and also from his bedroom on the other side up downstairs. Second of the last stop downstairs is the office. Which has its own bathroom or half bathroom. It has toilet and face space. And the only thing missing is a shower stall. So each villa, including this one, has its own kitchen. But if somebody is having a catered event and needs extra kitchen space, there is that facility here, an extra kitchen for that, for use of. So if you have some extra mouths to feed, <laughs> or just need extra cooking space, this is the place for it. And the caretaker's bedroom is here. It's not accessible right now, but as I had mentioned before, the bathroom was accessible from the laundry area as well. Next stop, and our final stop, for this villa is upstairs, which houses the three bedrooms, two bathrooms, and the kitchen. Our first bedroom is the primary, which has its ensuite bathroom. Again, like with the other villas, it has an inverter AC. The other two bedrooms are on the other side of upstairs, which affords it additional privacy. And they share a bathroom. Again, this villa has nice high vaulted ceilings.
and viewers completing the property tour and this particular villa is the kitchen and living kitchen living and dining room in one And the vaulted ceilings aren't spared even in this <laughs> space. So property viewers, thank you so much again for joining me on another property tour. Please remember to like, share, comment, and subscribe to this channel. Thank you.